Hey everybody, this is Descent Underground, a new Descent game by the guys at Descent Studios, and I want to say thank you to them for providing a review copy for this. This is the build I'm playing and have been playing is a pre-alpha release. It yeah, it has some stuff going for it, but not everything. Movement you can change. You can change all buttons to multiple different things, which I thought was kind of cool. Same with actions. There's a lot you can change. Sensitivities, from what I can tell, if you set these, the curve and scale to zero, it will just ignore it. It will set it back to one. Pretty much testing. I haven't used my Logitech controller with this. Which I find weird that it even brings up that and that. Like it pretty much says I have three plugged in. But I don't, which is weird. But... So pretty much, these are all five. The controls just seem decent for selecting stuff. So that's all five. The video is broke to hell. I have these things turned on. Pretty much all of these off besides simple lighting. You can, for me anyway, if you turn on everything and leave simple lighting on, It'll use about 70-ish GPU power with VSync turned on. If you turn VSync off, it'll use everything. Absolutely everything. I've gotten about 90, 90 to 110 FPS with those settings. Turning simple dy dynamic lighting off and having it just be full, I've dropped all the way down to 20 FPS. So that's not good. So I set everything to low or off and left VSync on because eh, I really don't care. Uh, that weapons, power ups, explosions, and packs. Weapons you could probably turn off, I think, because that's only for yours, I think. Power ups, it's the announcer's voice when you pick something up. Impacts, whenever you actually hit something. Whenever you actually hit something. With this version, for one, whenever you click start, it takes forever, it seems. You can start with three vehicles. The Wasp, the Panzer, and the Typhoon, which is having a seizure in the top right for some reason. Which, from what I can gather from the community chat on the website, is absolutely broken and the hitboxes are completely messed up. Now, from what I've played online with other people, which at the moment there's Vulcan like cannon. 10 Vulcan ammo. people Vulcan you ammo. can actually play with, because it's pre-alpha and there's not really going to be much people playing at the moment right now. Shield, energy but whenever I did play with people, the net code Laser seemed upgrade. really smooth and really generous. But Shield, just straight up moving Vulcan around, 
there's a few issues looking up and down which is extremely slow quad lasers. and they realize this because you can move left and right super easy looking up and down not so easy there's an issue and energy upgrade energy upgrade there's actually a really big issue with simple dynamic lighting if you have it turned on Megamism. well you can see what's happening the lighting isn't that great this barrier field thing in particular is terrible so you see it how it is now you can't really see through it it's kind of wacky turn it off You can see through it slightly better. Like you can see there's stuff over there. You can see that. But it's also probably running the GPU like at 100%. So I'm turning it off. It, yeah, and you can't really see that over there anymore. It's, it's bad. That needs to be fixed. Uh, the thing at the bottom middle, the radar, does absolutely nothing right now. There's no way to actually know where anything is coming from unless you see them. But at the moment, this is only a multiplayer either capture the core which you stay in one spot or stay in a certain area and capture the uh, thing which I have footage of which I'll add at the end and there's straight up deathmatch I think team deathmatch because you're I've noticed that they're in teams I think Those two are the only modes in this game right now, period. There is nothing else. At the moment, it's literally a multiplayer uh, shooter. They do plan on expanding it, from what I can tell, so that you can actually browse through matches. You can make matches, customize it how you want, and a single player campaign. They don't have that yet. They only have the two modes, the three ships, the, I think, three? Yeah, I think three maps, and that's it right now. I can see potential with this game after the control bugs are sorted out as it is right now unless you really want to help the uh, community expand because it's a descent game and I'm sure they can sell copies just on the name and I'm fairly sure people will be like this is amazing I don't care that it's multiplayer only. Yeah, right now, no one's online. Like, I have the community chat open in the second monitor. No one wants to play right now. At least no one is saying they want to play. But, would I recommend this? I would recommend it with the notion that... Quad lasers. Unless you want to help them with the game and help the community grow, laser upgrade. Go for it. Homing missile. It's not really Concussion a complete energy game upgrade restored. as it is right now. Concussion missile. So if you're thinking of, oh yeah, I'm gonna play the new Descent Underground because of the amazing single player campaign. 
Vulcan cannon. Vulcan ammo. Laser upgrade. So if you want the single player aspect, laser upgrade. I would hold off. But if you want to play pretty much Vulcan an arena ammo. shooter, that's a six degrees of freedom flying game. Grab it. Another thing I thought was hilarious. Quad laser store. Uh, with the multiplayer. Friendly fire is always turned off. One thing I hated, actually, there is no field of view options. So how do you change that? Open up the console and set the field of view because it's normally set to 90 by default. 90 is all right. I would prefer Energy upgrade. 110. There's no options for that at the moment so you have to manually put it in Holy missile. and there's some stupid stuff you can do like fov 500 this Laser is obviously upgrade. insanely Holy stupid missile. or say fov 200 yeah stuff is inverted now it's insane But, would I recommend it? If you want, as it is right now, the multiplayer, just an arena or capture the point game, grab it. It's not too bad so far, but if Make you it. want the... Uh, like if you're thinking of the older Descent games and how they had multiplayer, from my understanding, I've never played them. To hold off. Huh. But that'll be it. I'll have some actual gameplay about Capture the Core here in a moment. And I'll see everybody later. Vulcan cannon. Laser upgrade. Homing missile. Concussion Laser missile. Laser upgrade. Shield restored. Laser upgrade. Shield restored. Laser grid. Laser Vulcan cannon. Mega missile. Concussion missile.
Quad lasers. Concussion for laser cover. Energy upgrade. Laser home missile. Shield restored. Laser upgrade. Concussion missile. Energy upgrade. 